tale of this town, Cole. Lambs that go willingly to slaughter. Who the hell is that? Must be her lawyer. He certainly expedited her release. Game's getting harder. I'm getting all the questions wrong. We should follow her. Will we fine? <laughs> there she goes. Come on. Tell Jude. Tell us at a safe distance, so I shouldn't get too close. Well, I can flash red if you're telling too close, looking too far behind her, attracted to driving recklessly. I guess. Now it's definitely up to something. Now would be a bad time to forget how to drive, Cole. I think that's her car there. She seems to have made a remarkably speedy recovery. There she is. If the car flashes red, I'm too close. And then that's her car. Oh no. Yep, yeah, I think I messed this up, guys. Okay, she, if she's straight ahead, then I should be okay. I got it. <laughs> she wasn't that red car, she was some kind of green car. Is this Mark? Get in there and see what she's up to. Take cover at the door. Left control. Take cover at the door. Enter the without being seen. Hold and use A. Hold and use A to round the corner. Yep, I messed up. Damn, I was too slow. Too slow. This is awkward. X. Hold X to focus camera. Find a newspaper booth. Oh, messed it up. Mm, God damn it. God damn it, she saw me. Want it here. There, I think I know what to do. Get in there and see what she's up to. Oh my god, she gets me every single time. What am I meant to do? Would you recommend a special? The fuck? Well, I fucked up. <laughs> I don't know what to do now. She's gone? Did I just skip the whole scene? Yep, I skipped it. God damn it. So what's the story? I'm guessing she didn't stop for light refreshments. She made a call. Sounds like Mark Bishop has a heap of trouble headed his way. I've got an address. Wilson's Hotel. 
apartment 803. Oh, shit. You better step on it. If he's got any sense, he'll be as far away from home as possible. If he had any sense, he wouldn't have tried bumping off Guy McAfee's wife in the first place. Or he'd have done the job properly. McAfee will break a fella's legs just for looking at the girl. What did you make of the kid? You believe her story? I think she was doped out of her tiny mind. I didn't know what's going on. That fucking bitch Ballard sold her out. Missed the whole thing. Where am I going? So if Ballard was doing someone a favor, why did they try to kill her? This one is... I did not do a good job on this case. Let's go. Gun it. Let's get to the apartment before someone gets hurt. Damn. Let's go around here. Look at the map. Where am I? So oh, I don't think I'm anywhere in here. Trying to get there. Roger KGPL, 11K en route. So far away. Okay, I think I'm needy there now. Needy there. Yeah? So I don't even understand this case. I can't believe let me skip that whole section. Oh man, I think I'm gonna have to shoot people now. What does ends up me shooting somebody? Let's just not mess up this case too much. I'm Detective Phelps. We received a call about a domestic disturbance in apartment 803. Oh, the detectives. Listen, Mrs. Bishop's pretty upset. Uh, take the elevator and then left down the corridor. It's the last door on the right. So is somebody having an affair or what? I don't know. Take the door. No, 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 no. He said elevator to the right. Uh, what did he say? Oh, God, I don't know what he said. Well, let's just go. Sounds like we're about to make it a hat trick of hysterical female witnesses. Hat trick? Okay. Elevator to the right. Last to the right. He said something about right. Could it be this one? No. Not this one. God. Yes, I got it. LAPD, ma'am. Are you in danger? I'm all right now. You just missed them. Horrible, awful men. Are you injured, Mrs. Mrs. Bishop. Gloria Bishop. Gloria Please. Bishop. Okay. Come in, officers. I'll just need to sit down for a moment. Forgive me. That's perfectly normal, ma'am. Just look at this mess. We'll take a quick search of the premises, ma'am. If you take a moment to gather your thoughts. I, I will. Thank you, officer. Let's have a look at the clues. So what have I got so far? People? Movie producer associate of June Ballard. 
just look for evidence. I heard a little ding ding ding. Yeah? Well, they robbed the place and left jewelry behind. So they weren't after cash. Anything interesting? Ooh, check. Uh, 20,000. $20, Logan Apollo? 20 grand? What's the date? 27th of January. Anything else on here? No. Anything on the back? What are these? It doesn't appear to be connected. I'll put it down then. Something else here? A lot of letters here. Nah. Get out of here. New Testament. Wait a minute. Maybe there's something in the book. Are they trying to trick me? Mm, no. Nope. Gay cowboys to Mark. Presented to Mark. Bishop. Silver screen prop, prop, props. Gay cowboys. Okay. It's interesting. That clue? Still know where we're going. I think I missed something out. A big chunk of money. This isn't what we're looking for. <laughs> put it in, in your pocket. <laughs> nah, it's funny if you did. Hmm. Turn it around. That was a clue. Did not look like anything. Intolerance. Love struggle. Love struggle throughout the ages by D. W. Griffin. Great Wall of ba Babylon. Babylon. Babylon? Yeah, about Something more? Oh, I'm losing a phone number. I doubt it. Nothing. Nothing interesting here. This is gonna be a spoon I got no. Do I go anywhere? Nope. Look around here. Are you looking at a clock? It's just a clock, my friend. This doesn't pertain to the case. Ooh, another picture. Funny face. Made in the background. Silver screen. Who are these men in the picture? My husband, Mark, and Marlon Hopgood. They work together on occasion. That's Hopgood's shop. Okay, person, new personal interest. At least we're getting somewhere. 
Don't know where, but... Eddie... Optimistic call. Doesn't seem like anything. Oh. Balcony. Oh. Nice. Talk to the lady. Domestic disturbance. Wife of Mark Bishop and, ass and assault victim. Mm. Those men. I think they work for Guy McAfee. Do you know the name? No. Why should I? Is he guy? Ballard is married to Guy McAfee. Is he a gangster her? or something? That slut. She's been badgering my husband for days. Mrs. McAfee alleges that your husband tried to kill her and her friend last night. I think you should tell us what you know. My husband's a movie producer. This has something to do with his new picture. He doesn't include me in his business. Mm. You lie, I'm not doubt. Because we're not going to get any waves, so she's telling the truth. June Ballard said she had a deal to be in his new picture. Mark repeatedly told her no. He had Joan Leslie lined up for the role. That's how he got the finance. June made all kinds of threats. She was very rude to me. You know June Ballard? We were both on the same picture a few years back. That's how I met my husband. <laughs> so, was June blackmailing Mark Bishop, the producer, to be in his movie? And did he try to kill her? Or? Word. Whereabouts of Bishop? Check abuse of blood. Let's just go for whereabouts of Bishop. Where can we find your husband, ma'am? He told me he would be on set. That's all I know. She's done in truth. Either we find him, or McAfee's people do, Mrs. Bishop. If you care for him, you should make sure that we find him first. I do care for him. But I don't really know where he'd go if he were in trouble. Hopgood might know. Okay, trace dress of prop store. Abuse of Jessica Hampton. I'm just going to go for the check, then I'll go for that one. Why is your husband paying Lorna Hopgood $20,000? Lorna? Lorna Hopgood. Ex well, there's so many characters. Damn. Are you sure? Are you sure? Should I go for lie and then go for the check? Three, let's go for lie. You're lying, Mrs. Bishop. It's some kind of payoff. You know exactly what the money is for and who it's getting paid to. Do I? Would you like to prove that, detective? Oh, damn. Let's just go for this one. You're wrong, detective. My husband is a miscreant, but that doesn't mean he feels shame for what he does. He would never tell me. So ask her next question. Fuck that one up. What's she doing? She seems calm. Your husband was at a casting yesterday with a young girl? Not that I know of. He told me he was looking at locations. The picture's been cast. Doubt. That I don't know of. Yeah, doubt. Jessica remembered a mermaid. The mermaid on the front of the prop store. You better come clean with me. Did she? Sick town don't remember saying anything like that. Are you sure you really want to know? The truth is, my husband likes them young. Oh. Do you think that's okay? I was 16 when I first met him. I thought he was a genius, a magician with film. I was 20 before I realized he was just a B-movie hack. But he's nothing compared to some of the monsters at these big studios. My guess is Ballard sacrificed her little friend. Happens to a lot of girls. 
Your husband is in trouble. It could go easier for him if you were more helpful, Mrs. Bishop. He's a big boy, Detective, and so are you. This is Hollywood. There's always a deal to be done. Shitload experience from that. I've done really well. Oh, I need to use the phone. Where is the phone? The phone be. Is the phone here? No. What's this? Another clue? Alright, let's have a look at this. It's the. It's the butter. I've not seen a phone in the whole house. I'm sure I would have noticed a phone. Here is a phone. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Operator, message for KGPL. Putting you through now. Phelps badge 1247. How could I help, Detective? I need a location on a silver screen prop store. Just a moment. Silver screen props. Corner third and Figueroa. Thanks. Phone call is been made. Let's get out of here.